creative. And also inclusion. Happy, Happy community day! day. If I were the principal of the high school, I would increase the dignity by welcoming teachers and students, being inclusive at the school, and being a good role model. Um, as a teacher or as future teachers in the MTEP program here, we would increase our dignity by setting rules for the classroom, for example, anti-bullying, because a lot of students are being bullied and a lot of students are bullying to other students. We would also praise or encourage students we always have to like encourage for example you did a great job or I didn't win and we would also encourage or treat everyone equally as mayor we would Increased dignity by communication, hearing everyone's concerns about the community, showing love, peace, and respect to one another, and making a difference to make the community a better and stronger place. Uh, for me being Prime Minister, what I would change is first thing is probably the education system with the support. Because I noticed here there's not really much support and like, I would probably like, get some, gather some teachers up and gather some, like, hire some more teachers, get them to, like, get more training of, to understand what the kids really are and who they are. And, like, kind of like a bonding thing. Like, should, like, make them train for bonding and just, like, better support and a better system. And the second thing I would do is help, help empower them. Help empower the youngsters to speak up more and make them realize they actually have a voice. Because here the teachers are kind of up here with their talkings, and the students are more down here. And if we could kind of like balance it out a bit, I would think more like it would actually, school would actually work out and things would actually go well and do stuff. And the third thing I would definitely do is create more job opportunities. Like, the jobs that you don't need to get like, graduated because these these days you need a, you need the graduation to get a job and like I kind of like um what they do down south they do like the cans and the bottles like recycling and like, just make more opportunities for people who don't have jobs and who has no education entrepreneurship yeah exactly. Thank you. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us here for Global Dignity Day. I'm Jamie and this is Daniel and Jennifer and we'd really like to thank you all for inviting us to be part of this incredible event today. One of the things that we've been working on for Global Dignity Day this year is about deepening our sense of social connectedness and how it relates to dignity. And Daniel and Jennifer are going to talk about some of the artwork that we've been taking part in as part of our work with Taking It Global. Well, we're standing in front of five images that were selected from hundreds around the world on the theme of moments of inclusion. And Daniel actually has one of the pieces here that he'll tell you about. But before he explains it, I'll just tell you that this one is from Taiwan. We have uh, one from Eastern Canada, we have one from Toronto, we have one from Brazil, and one from Nunavut. So Daniel, can you tell us about this piece? It's a photograph, right? Yeah. Um, 
on this day, we actually went about 50 or 60 miles out of town. And we're actually stopping for a supper break. So we decided to get out to try to find and take out a couple pictures. And we got to... Actually, I didn't really plan to submit them, but then I guess that plan got me here. Yeah. Um, and can you talk about, well, all right, so just last night I flew in from Toronto and together with a group of youth we created some artwork and uh, maybe we can just send a message that art has the power to foster both a sense of belonging and a sense of dignity. Um, and maybe you could just share one last thought about what art means for you. What art means for me, um, well, it's a way to express myself, a way to show different feelings that I can't say in words, so art is one way to express my feelings. Yeah. So we hope you get out there and create more art. Happy Global Dignity Day. Woo! Thanks, everybody.